up everybody? My name is Jack Quinn. Welcome back to the channel. It is day three and it is our Magic Kingdom day. We are wearing, we are all wearing grad shirts. I am wearing my graduation cap with Mickey ears. I've got my class of 2023 pin. Here we go. Let's see how the day goes. All right, so we're in the Magic Kingdom. My Magic Band Plus right. is vibrating yeah, as it went into. I'm very sorry. And uh, we're trying to figure out what ride to go on. We didn't get a virtual queue for Tron. App just wasn't working apparently. And so we didn't get a virtual queue, but we did get Lightning Lane. So we're gonna get Lightning Lane for Tron and do that. We're in for early hours, early park hours. We are going to try to uh, to get some rides on times. We are entering the land of tomorrow. Alrighty, we are in line for Space Mountain. First ride of the day. I'm not recording because for me, I can see. But on camera, it's pitch black. So I'm not gonna record. So, I'll give you guys updates when we get out of Space Mountain. Alright, first ride, out of the way. Next one, we have our lightning lane for Tron. So we're gonna go hit Tron at the moment. You guys are gonna get along for a nice ride, as this ride it's only just opened. So you guys is gonna you guys are gonna get an exclusive look at the new Tron Light Cycle run. We're here. This is Tron. Let's go and have fun. So we rode Tron. Ultimately, it was really cool. The inside portion was really neat. The way the lighting effects were were really neat. But personally, it felt too short. The ride itself just felt way too short. Um, I got ride footage. I recorded it. But the problem was the camera fell down. So you didn't get to see much. Pretty much as soon, because this is like the second half of the hill. That initial launch and then that first up, the camera flips down and you couldn't see anything. So if we go on it again, I will get try and get better camera footage, hopefully. Hopefully the camera stays up that time. But overall, the ride was cool itself. It just felt short. That's all I got to say about it, it just it felt short. <laughs> we're gonna go, we're gonna get some waffles over at uh, Storybook Cafe. And it might rain, which good thing I brought my waterproof case for the camera. I was smart this time, I'm ahead of the curve. Uh, well, it didn't on the first day we were here. But, we're now exiting Tomorrowland. What are we doing after we get our waffles? Uh, pirates. Pirates? It's a pirate site. But, as you can see, we're in Adventure, or, yeah, Adventureland. So, I guess I'm throwing something in the trash. We're in Adventureland, we're gonna try and hit Jungle Cruise and Pirates at the same time. I'm still bummed. Splash Mountain doesn't exist here anymore. It's closed. It's getting rebuilt to Tiana's Bayou Adventures, so... There's no water rides in Magic Kingdom. Alright, as you can see, 
we're in line for Jungle Cruise. It's time for the back of the water. You're fired. You're too good at your job. You're setting the bar too high for the rest of us. We strive for mediocrity here, and you darn well know it, all right? No, you can't go home. We're understaffed. Yeah, keep going. <laughs> Sorry to witness that, friends. Anyone who is genuinely entertaining and a pleasure to be around is just not cut out for this job, and they have to be dealt with accordingly. But now you're trying to make in progress. Jump. That was interesting. There you can see the work being done for Tiana's Bayou Adventure. Yeah, I think they're putting a the restaurant next to it. Well, I think that they've still got to add the little Mama Odie's boat house. We'll take a look over here. Oh, dry. All right, now we're in Frontierland and we're working our way to Big Thunder Mountain Railroad. Cause this here's the wildest ride in the
You get whipped around more in the back. Uh, it's a lot, a lot more bumpy than the one. All right, well, we just got off of... Watch my toes. I wasn't going to catch it. Meow. <laughs> but we just got off of Thunder Mountain Railroad. Uh, what ride are we doing next? Yes. Yay. Haunted Mansion ride. This is my favorite. So. I love that ride. But first, I need to find a bathroom. There's one over by Country Bears, I believe. But it is humid. It is. It's it's humid. It's very humid here. But we are so far getting th pretty, pretty much gotten through a good chunk of rides here. So. We're probably going to stay until park closing because of the fireworks show that's coming in here soon. So, over the happily ever after, it's something that I haven't seen in person. So, we're pro I want to stay for that. So, we're going to try and stay till park close. Here we go to the stretching room. When the inches creak. on my camera. It is. Oh, yeah. It's coming down pretty good here. Okay. As for usual, it's Disney. Well, 
Do we brave it or do we stay here? Well, it's just going to be wet anyway, so it's not going to get dry. So I don't want my close. shoes to get soaked. All right, I guess we're braving it. Okay, <laughs> it stopped. We got out and it just stopped. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's like I've got, I'm not getting anything to die, but Oh boy. Bathroom, get some paper towels. Rapunzel's bathroom is just over there. Oh, go grab some for me. Here, you put that in there. Yep, go run and grab some. I guess I... Like you. Oh well, I guess I have been tasked with uh, grabbing paper towels, but like it was just pouring down rain, pissing down rain as we got out, as you guys saw. And then it just stopped as we were still walking out of the exit. Like we hadn't even fully left the exit line. And it stopped. Eddie! I don't know why, I don't know how. It's Florida, it's unexplainable. Alrighty, so we couldn't have timed that any better. We got off of Haunted Mansion and started making our way towards the Adventureland Spring Roll Cart. And we caught the very end of the parade. We timed that pretty well spot on. Because the parade is over. The parade is over in Main Street right now. Uh, I want to try them both. both I kind of want to try both as well. We'll get four lots, then you guys shoot it. That one, that both as well. I was like, or we can just do, uh, yeah, I guess that doesn't. I think you can do one and one. Just get three. Just get, three, you know, one and one. You can, can split you it do? up and do, I think you can split it up and do one and one. The I'm sure spring you can roll ask, cart. You can ask if they can do like good. one and one. And if that's the case. So we're going to try and see if we can Cause get want, one and one. I imagine because they have, well, you they have the cheeseburger spring roll. Choice of two spring rolls. Choice of two. So you get one of each. All right, go. All right, go. Hi, can we do um, three orders? We have uh, one of each in each order. Yeah. Okay. Here, We're getting your spring rolls. That. So, you have your cheeseburger spring rolls, or you have pastrami and pepper jack spring rolls. So, I will go over here to kind of show you what they look like. Good choice of two. That's your spring rolls. With mustard dipping sauce, or you can get like a cheeseburger dipping sauce for your spring rolls. Uh, don't run me over. I tried not to, but. <laughs> and these are really good stuff. Really good spring rolls, so. If you ever are in Walt Disney World, you're in Magic Kingdom, and you're on your way to Adventureland, stop by the Spring Roll Cart and get your spring rolls. We're gonna do a uh, little food review for yeah. you guys once we get actually get them, so you can actually see how good they are. We've tried the spring uh, cheeseburger spring rolls, but we haven't had the pastrami and pepper jack, so you guys are gonna be in for a bit of a surprise and a treat here. Here we go. Got a nice, delicious spring rolls. Stayed there. You should have stayed there. Yeah, I want to drive it. This is dry. Whatever. It's dry ish. Dry enough. I don't think they're, very, like, they're not very crispy, but I guess they are. They just didn't look it. They looked like kind of They looked look soggy. Like, which in one's there. which? Do we know? No idea. This is a pastrami. Okay. Alright. We're going to have to open these up here. This is the first time. I kind of had to open it up to see what it looked like. Got that. Yeah, I want it supposed to rain. Mmm. Pastrami pepper jack is good. Pastrami one is good. 
Or it's just that tree that's okay. dripping on the So that's the inside of it. And I say, it's really good. It's really tasty, even with the, the mustard dipping sauce. It's got a good taste, it's got a good flavor. All right, so now this is a cheeseburger spring. Use them. Okay. I think I like the charmy one better. The charmy one is good. And that's the inside of the cheeseburger sprinkle. And it had like a little, it's like a little like sriracha mayo type of dip. No, it's special sauce. Special sauce? Like so like Big Mac sauce. Like Big Mac sauce. Mm. That was really good stuff. So, I highly recommend going to the spring roll cart for a good snack. A good, savory snack. We caught it just it's starting to rain again. As soon as we finished eating our cheeseburger spring rolls, it started raining again. And we have a, a pass for Seven Doors Mine Train. And it's coming down, I can feel it. It's coming down a bit heavier now. But anyway, we we're kind of standing under cover for right now in case it rains. But we're over by Seven Dwarfs Mine Train. Didn't find what we were looking for. Hassle in my face. We didn't find what we were looking for. We we're trying to find spoons. Still haven't found any spoons. How'd it go? So. Did you guys get in before the We're having problems. We're having problems. Like my but are oh, we gonna take them on? Okay. Like, I don't mind leaving back to the beach. But as you can see, we just got a virtual queue for a Tron light cycle while in the parks. It was probably easier to get it in the parks because no, not everyone. It's never easier. Never easier. Never easier. Never easier. Really? I would have thought. Than the park. I would have thought it would be harder be, or easier because pe most people are out doing things. They're not going to be no. on their it's, phone. It seems, if for whatever reason, it seems harder to get it. At, well, the, the whatever. But hey, we, hey, we got, got it. Yesterday to get one. Oh, but no, then we already had one. We had already got one for earlier. For whatever. I want to do. The key though. Did I take it out already? Or did I, I, I got it. I was so. like, I took it out already. She's like, you better have the key. You better have the key. You better have the key. But as you, as you guys saw, we got the virtual queue. My mom was the one that got it for us. So no, we're gonna go row. One yesterday morning too, so. Wait, was it you? Yes. Huh. Apparently I'm the lucky, tr the lucky charm. I guess so. Or well, I've got the fastest finger. I mean, if you had fast fingers, you'd be beating us in- uh, Whatever. In Buzz and Toy Whatever. Story. <laughs> Or maybe my phone's just better than all yours. Did you ever think about that? Maybe I have the better phone with better internet. I mean, I do have the S22 Ultra. <laughs> yeah, but I got I got us yesterday too. So that's what I'm thinking. Maybe my so, internet's faster than here. We're gonna ride it again. I'm gonna try and get footage again because I didn't get footage the last time because well, I didn't. I pulled a stupid and didn't tighten the camera tight enough. So we're gonna try it again. Woo! Oh, Jesus. I'm in the very back, so I'm getting whipped around. Good thing about these cars too, they sway. <laughs> this is good.
Oh. Right check. Oh. That's a pretty. Alrighty. Where are we going to now? Well, we're going to find a bathroom, but where after that? Um. Hey, right. Like, right. We've got a pass for something. I can't remember what. Buzz? No, well, no, we've got that. People mover. People mover. Ah, uh, okay. But so Buzz going, as well. Okay, so we're going back to Tomorrowland. After Seven Dwarves. It is nice. My thing is buzzing. My hey. thing was buzzing. I wonder. I wonder. I wonder. No. Oh, maybe. Yep, mine buzzed. It buzzed. Some of the 50th anniversary characters around here. It buzzes. It does something. What it does? I have no idea. Uh, but we're gonna go back into Tomorrowland. We're just trying to find a bathroom because we kind of needed to after being stuck inside for a good period of time. Uh, we're gonna do People Mover, Buzz Lightyear, and Tron again because we got that virtual queue, remember? So we're gonna go and we're gonna have fun. Alrighty. We just finished taking some graduation pictures. I am hot. I am taking this off for right now. Backing it up. Yep. You can't get in because people cut the stool right on top of you. Yep. I try to be courteous and not purple. I don't know how other people said that they can't get in. Yes, I'll take my hat. Trade you. Here. Chucking on. And then watch the 361 going to be there and we're going to be like, oh, let's put it all back on. If it is, then no worries. It's all in the bag. Oh my goodness, it's hot. It's not hot, it's like it's humid. It's very moist right now. You're oh. moist? Cloud cover. It's cloud cover. But, uh, what next? What next? Tiana. Okay. And then we'll go from there. Over here at the Main Street Confectionery. <laughs> Making up some camel dip apples. Alrighty, so our virtual queue group has gotten called for Tron Light Cycle. We're gonna go back. I'm gonna try again at getting footage. Yeah. But uh this time we actually get to experience You're the full queue though. Like, well, because they're probably backed up because of people that had virtual queue when it was shut down. True. So we're going to try and get more but footage. They issued all those groups, they were trying to get them through. And uh, we'll see how it goes. There's. If you want to test how the <laughs> how the bike will sit and how you will sit in the bike you can right there we can okay dokie Attempt number two at Tron Light Cycle footage. Get it, Nora. Prepare for Team Blue Light Cycle Run upload sequence. Remember, hold on, keep your head up, and face forward.
and victory for Team Blue. That was awesome. Oh, that was awesome. Just too bad it's short. It's too bad it's short. It was awesome. I wish it was a little bit longer. Users, watch your step as you dismount and exit. Be sure to collect your belongings. time we have rode Tron Light Cycle Run. We're gonna exit the Magic Kingdom now, but finally, I got my camera to stay up on that time, so you guys, let me know in the comments down below what you think of Tron Light Cycle Run and see if you want to actually ride it yourself. Now, now, we're gonna leave the Magic Kingdom for a little bit. We're gonna go meet up with some other Never Grow Up travel agents um, from Never Grow Up Vacations. And we're gonna have dinner over at the Polynesian Resort over at Captain Cook's. So, we're gonna do that. I might be coming back into the parks later on. We will see. The Tomorrowland Speedway. Alrighty, we are on the ferry boat. We're going to the Polynesian Resort. Don't drop it. Yeah, put the wrist strap on. Put the wrist strap on. Put it on this wrist. I like your little wrist on, just put it on. Stuck to my wrist to the person. But it has been a long day already. Taking hair off of it. Time to relax, get some food. Alrighty, well, we just finished uh, whatever we're doing at Polynesian, at Polynesian Resort. We're now gonna get on the monorail. And where are we going? I don't know, transportation hub, then bus to I don't know. We'll figure it out. Somewhere, we're going somewhere. <laughs> We're going somewhere, but the, uh, what was it? Captain Cook's, wasn't it? Where we were at? Yeah, so Captain Cook is a mobile order service, so you can mobile order and order ahead. Yeah, it's a little like food court at the, at the Polynesian Resort. I suggest getting the, what was it? It was the Hawaiian pork nachos. Pulled pork nachos. Pulled pork nachos and the Thai coconut, coconut meatballs. Those are good. So if you stay at Polynesian or if you want to come to Polynesian Resort to Captain Cook's, get those two things because they were good. Alrighty, so. Me and my parents have kind of split ways. They're gonna go to Port Orleans to get some beignets and beignet sundaes. I have decided to stay in the Magic Kingdom because I am staying true to my word and I am doing park opening to rope drop. We are doing this. We're doing it. You guys are gonna come with me. Okay, so this is the Magic Band Plus. And this is one of the 50th anniversary statues that kind of goes around the park. And if you keep it near it, it actually interacts with the statues. And it's really cool. 
First time I walked up here to test it, it barked. It, it played sound. It was barking, as it is for you in the train. It's also doing that now. That's cool. That is cool. These are awesome. I like the Magic Band Pluses just solely because it lights up and it interacts with stuff throughout the park. So that in itself is really cool. So get a Magic Band Plus. <laughs> it interacts with stuff within the ride as well. Like on Tron, when before we started the initial launch, these were flashing like an identity disc in like the Tron colors. On Haunted Mansion, these started like beeping as like a heart rate. It like vibrated and buzzed as if it was like a heart rate. That was cool. There was also, um, uh, what, like on park entry, it vibrates. When you scan into a ride, it vibrates. And it just, there's other statues as well that it interacts with and it vibrates with those statues. And it's, it's really cool to do and it's really cool to see. And the fact you can customize the lights. I've got it set to red normally. So when like you scan into the park or whatever, it like, will, it'll go red. But there's certain magic bands have a certain theme to the, to the band. So like mine has an Iron Man theme or Avengers color theme or whatever. But on certain rides, it actually would do a color theme to whatever ride that you're at. So like on Tron, once you exit the ride, it does blue, orange, green, and red, which is really cool. So yeah. it's definitely cool for like the interactive perspective with the Magic Band, it gives you something a little extra to do. But if you're not an overall big fan of like all that, then you can get a regular Magic Band. That's totally fine. It's up to you. But I would highly suggest getting a Magic Band Plus. Alrighty. Oh, oh, that's a puddle that I just stepped in. All right, we're approaching Stitch. So, let's see what happens when we approach Stitch. So far, it just seems to be blinking in this blue. That is another one of the 50th anniversary statues that they had placed in the park. I'm just a couple minutes away from watching Happily Ever After. Right there. We're, let's see, we're just over five minutes. Just over five minutes before Happily Ever After starts. I'm going to record the first little segment of it, but the rest of it I'm going to enjoy for myself. Alright, we are less than a minute away. So we're right there. Desire. It calls to us. When I move to the front, and when we're brave enough to 
this. We want to hold to pursue and we will lead us on a journey to discover who we are meant to be. All we have to do is look inside our hearts and unlock the magic. Oh, it's so much Tron looks like at night and I have to say it looks pretty damn cool at night this is really cool the way that it looks at night that's that's awesome
That is awesome. That is actually really awesome. That's cool. Okay, I just discovered something. Haunted Mansion is at the rare 13 minute mark. So we're going to Haunted Mansion. I cannot see anything because of this light and it is dark as hell here going down Storybook Circus. But Haunted Mansion has a 13 minute wait, so we're going. Well, we didn't make it in time until the park closed. It's unfortunate, but we'll be here tomorrow. So hopefully we can catch Haunted Mansion when it's at that 13 minute wait. Cause that isn't a rare thing for the Disney parks. Cause most of the time it's in digits of five. So it ends in a five or a zero for the wait times. The lowest it can be is five minutes. And the max is, I don't know how much. You very rarely see Haunted Mansion or any attraction with a 13 minute wait. And it's only for Haunted Mansion and I believe Tower of Terror. There's the only two rides that have that 13 minute wait label because number 13, unlucky number 13 is a thing. So, I am sweaty trying to book it to Haunted Mansion before the park closed. <laughs> but the park closed. We didn't make it in time. But, that's okay. My band buzzed because I was over at Winnie the Pooh and Piglet. There's a statue of Pooh. Uh, but all jokes aside, <laughs> This means that day three is coming to an end. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like that, hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon to be notified whenever I upload again. And as always, we do have a subscription for 10% off your online order at doobieenergy.com. There will be more gaming clips coming to the channel. Those are going to be coming out within the next, like, month. Um, I'm hot today, okay? Leave me alone. Um, use, Quin, uh, use promo code QUIN77 to get your 10% off. And, as always, I will see you guys in the very next video. Peace out.